Here you're looking at August Lundberg, a friend of George Bellows and a fellow painter. He is standing, bust length, a cigar in his hand, and he's looking directly at you, the viewer, with a very fierce, alluring and somehow seductive gaze. This is very important on many levels. The first one because it proves Bellows' talent at capturing the psychology of his model, and also because it ties him with the art of Thomas Aikens and James Whistler, for example, which were big references for Bellows at the time and which also helped to anchor the Ashken movement into the history of art. If you care to notice the palette that is used, you'll see a lot of warm browns, maroons and blacks, which all subtly contrast with the only dash of white in the portrait around the sitter's neck. But all those colors give you an idea of warmth and generosity that not only translates from the relationship between Bellows and the sitter, who was his friend, but also because it gives you an idea of what Ashkan portraiture should be at that time all about that link, that heartfelt moment between the sitter and the viewer. Finally, it's also an important portrait because it was, as you can see by the brushwork, executed very quickly to suggest the immediacy of the scene and to strengthen the connection between you and this model. Mm -hmm.